I knew about the Flint water crisis for a long time. I didn't know how bad it was. Once I figured that out and how bad it was and got to talk to some of my friends who are living in Flint and you know, hearing their, exper hearing their experiences, I was thinking like, what could I do? These are my friends, these are my teachers, these are my teammates. I have a teammate whose family is from Flint. Um, at Central Michigan, there's a large population of people from Flint, and they are directly being affected by this. And because those are my friends, you know, it's very, it's a personal thing. So that, you know, that drives you to want to help out even more. And I knew uh, Suji, our coach. She's one of those uh, type of coaches you don't see very often. She, it's just as important to her the type of people that we are off the court as we are on the court. So because of that, I knew if I bring something like this to her, that she would be all for it. And that's exactly what happened. I. Actually, I said, Coach, can we do a game where we collect water for Flint? She said, Jazz, that's a great idea in her, if you know her voice. You know, she was so excited about it immediately. She went and talked to athletics. They were all behind it. They came up with some great ideas, you know, the drop-off points, the times. So I was so happy that they, they just, you know, they were all for it and they got behind it like that. My only goal is just to help in any way we can. If we only help one family in Flint, we're still helping a family. I mean, it's just, it's just a matter of helping people who need help.